Hello, beautiful souls. Welcome to my channel. It is the Soul Leader. So, today, this video is about be seen and not heard. And the Lord gave me this word in a moment of prayer, of gratitude um, for the blessings in my life and the lessons. And the be seen I heard was about a moment of me realizing a spirit, spirit that followed me my entire life. And the spirit that I'm talking about is that I don't know if it's fear or what or what to call it, but I'm not even going to give it a name. Let's just say it's just something that I know that always followed me. And it's like, I grew up in a family where as though I was seen, but not heard. I was always told to shut up and be quiet, you know? And I found myself almost making that mistake in my own relationship with other people, even my own children. And in the moments of correction, it's like, it made me realize how through even friendships and relationships, how it was the same thing, um, be seen and not heard. But the Lord is telling me today that you are seen and you are heard. Because he is blessing you. The Lord is blessing me. You know. And the Lord is like. He's doing it in a way that. I couldn't even imagine. You know. It's like. I think about. Even Sunday word with um, watching Stephen Ferdy. It wasn't. Um, I didn't, he didn't pass to this. to um, On Sunday. It was a preacher from. Um. From um from Baltimore um what's his name is it Xavier it I I'm sorry I don't remember his name but um I know I remember he has glasses um I know he wears glasses and he's tall but I know he's from Baltimore um but anyway um and he said a lot of things you know um that made me realize you know, who I am. And then the Sunday before last, um, when Steve Furtick preached about um, closed doors, closed and open doors, you know. And um, I thank God for every closed door. I thank God for every person who rejected me, every job, every everything, anything I applied for, for the rejection because had I not had that rejection, I would not be in this moment. I would not be in this place. I would not be in this mindset. I would not have taken pain and turned it into something positive. You know, um, I'll, I'll say this and I'll end the video that even though the people who made you feel like you were just seen and not heard, forget that. Don't even focus on it. Don't even worry about it. The reason why you were seen, meaning they know who you are. <laughs> they know who you are, but they're not trying to hear you because you're not speaking their language. You know, you're not, you're not, you're not um, who they are. You're different. You possess something that they don't. So they'll hate you for it. And it doesn't mean necessarily they always being mean and stuff. It's more so like people will use like puppets and they don't even know it, you know? And it's like for all those who didn't see and hear you, there are those that do see you and that do hear you. And they're coming to your rescue. And they're coming to be your friends. And they're coming to love you. And they're coming to help nurture you. And they're coming to be, they're coming to be all those things that you have been to those who did not see you those who did not hear you and to those who did see you but did not want to hear you i'm i'm confirming that for you now you know so with that being said beautiful souls let me help you and together we can help one one another